Hi everyone, in this tutorial we're going to learn how to read and play the G major scale with the circle of fifths. Now you might be thinking, what on earth is a circle of fifths? Do not worry, we'll explain everything in a simple and concise manner. The circle of fifths is a music theory tool that helps us to understand the relationship between musical keys. It's called the circle of fifths because each note is five notes away from the previous one. So if we start with C, the next note in the circle is G, then D, and so on. By using the circle of fifths, we can figure out what sharps are featured in each major scale. In the example of G major, this features the F sharp. Now rather than showing this every time an F note is present, we add the sharp symbol to the key signature, which is placed to the right of the clef. That means whenever the F note is written in a piece of music, it automatically becomes an F sharp, unless a natural symbol has been introduced. Now let's start with the G major scale. The scale consists of seven different notes starting with the G and ending with the G an octave higher. Played on a keyboard, G major sounds like this. The formula more commonly used for a major scale is whole tone, whole tone, half tone, whole tone, whole tone, whole tone, and half tone. Now for all you budding guitarists out there, we will look at how to play the complete G major scale in open form. We will start with the open third string, which is note G, then play the notes in the following order and positions. Congratulations! You just learned how to play the G major scale on both the piano and guitar with the help of the circle of fifths. Now keep practicing and experimenting with different musical keys to become a better musician. Now while I remove the picks that have fallen into my guitar, this video on the C major scale will take your skills to the next level.